Hey guys, Aaron here with Rip Body Yoga. I uh, just want to go over some basic stretches to do that um, are really essential um, so you don't get hurt to stretch out some of the parts of the body before we start doing some more intense exercising with yoga. So, you know, a basic one, reach up to the sky, lengthen out through your fingertips, and then bring it over to the side, just stretching out your side bodies. Inhaling, come up, exhale over to the side. Again, inhale, come through center. Exhale over, inhale up, exhale over, and keep your belly engaged and pulled in the whole time. Good, and bring the arms back. Interlace your fingers behind your back, so it looks like this. Pull your, your hands down, and bring your ear to your shoulder and hold. And just stretching out the side of your neck. And back through center, ear to shoulder and hold. And back through center. Again, ear to shoulder. Inhale, center. Exhale, over. Good. Back to center. You can release your hands now. Just see, maybe use your hands. Just bring your chin to your chest. Good. And maybe look to the right. And other side. Just stretching out the neck and the shoulders. Taking some shoulder rolls back. Big shoulders, big rolls of your shoulders, and then come forward. Way up high, coming forward. Good. Then some circles with your arms, just warming up chest, the shoulder, the back. And moving with your breath. Maybe inhaling, come up, exhale around. Inhale. Exhale around. Inhale and exhale, other side. Big stretches. Good. Another direction. Good. And shake out your arms. Just swing side to side. Allowing your arms just to hit your side as you swing. So we're warming up the back, but we're not going very intensely yet. We're just gently warming it up. And stretch out the tricep. So right hand will bend, right, hand, right arm will bend, left hand grabs, right elbow just pull down. And switching sides, right hand will grab left elbow and pull it down. You're gonna take your take one arm across your body and use the other arm to pull, so stretching out the deltoid of the shoulder. And anytime we're holding a stretch like this, it's nice just to take some breath and send the breath into whatever body part you're you're working. And other side, right arm across. Good. Now come back so you can see me. Interlace your hands behind your back. Just inhaling, open up the chest. And then fold forward with your arms coming over your head. Good. And you can just keep a bend in your knees and just go side to side. Shaking your head yes, shaking your head no, rocking side to side. And what you could do after that to warm up your shoulders is you can begin to warm up your hips. I'll show you what I mean. So come into a tabletop, hands under shoulders, take some cat cows, inhaling. And exhale, warming up the back. So inhaling as we lift the chest, exhaling as we round the back. And take circles with your hips in one direction. And then another direction. Good. Maybe press into a down dog, bend one knee, bend the other knee, walk your feet up to your hands, 
Spread your feet hip distance apart, interlace your arms, bend your knees here and just hang out. Again, you can rock side to side. Just taking some nice breaths, then release your hands to the floor, bend the knees slowly, roll up to stand. And that's a good beginner practice. So if you're newer to yoga, um, that can be your yoga practice. Just kind of feeling into different parts of your body, breathing and moving. Um, that took all about, you know, three to four minutes. And that's something that you could do every day if you're newer to yoga and just want something to, to help move your body. Okay, Aaron, Rip Body Yoga. See you soon.